Ken Bruce with Dirt Track Dodgers. We're here with uh, runner-up tonight at the uh, King of the Blue Rock race, Stuart Friesen. You just uh, got a little late going there. Yeah, for sure. And uh, guest videographer, John Tiff, on the camera. So, um, no, for sure. We uh, we went a little hard on tires, I think, for the track tonight. Went with our notes from last year, and, and it was good at the end. Um, just a little bit uh, too little, too late. So, congrats to Fuller. He was quick, you know, at the beginning. Fired off, and um, he made the right call tonight. But um, our Helmar team, team's been good. You know, a lot of momentum uh, last few weeks, and uh, another good run tonight. You know, th on the Super Dirt Car Series, you got three wins and a second. Uh, yeah, I don't know if you can run the whole season or not because of, you know, NASCAR, but uh, it's a good way to start it off. Yeah, for sure. Uh, good good points tonight for us, and, um, you know, we'll see it, see what happens in the next coming weeks. Uh, there's a couple conflicts coming up, but um, for sure, uh, you know, we got got a great, great program here. Um, with the big box, Billy, the kids are doing a great job. Bicknell Chassis and and uh, and all our great product sponsors, as always. Uh, Tommy Conroy's been working really hard, and um, you know Kevin Ayers, all our our Jersey crew, Dickie and Wendy, and um, Tom Belmont down here tonight. So um, good group of guy, group of guys, and um, you know just want to thank them for all the help. And being, I was early in the race, I was watching you because usually you make that patented charge there. It seemed like you, I don't know if you were laying back or just waiting for tires to come in, but you sort of fell back a few spots there. I think at one time you were like 14th. Yeah, for sure. Uh, just a little bit hard, you know. They they kind of surprised us with the track prep they did, um, which was great. It was it was good racing all the way through, uh, but we just didn't fire off like we needed to to get to the front. So had to had to wait for the tires to fire off. And once they did, we were good. Um, you know, I don't know what we could have done different or, or would have done different with the car, but um, you know, is what it is. Yeah. I asked a couple of the other guys I interviewed tonight. Um, you know, you've been to a lot of tracks in the country. How do you you know compare this track to you know some tracks? Well, that's that's good. It's definitely unique, uh, very racy. Um, you know, it sets up for really good runs. You know, off the corners, you can get in the bottom really good and make make some ground, but then you're kind of a sitting duck on exit. So, um, gets pretty exciting, three four wide, and um, you know, definitely a, a unique track for us in the Northeast. And and you know, Doug and the whole group here have done an excellent job with it. All right, Stuart. So, uh, once again, we're with Stuart Friesen here, third place finisher, finisher the King of the Big Box race here at Bridgeport.